All right. It's recording. What do you mean, other fragments? I don't know what else to say. After the earthquake, a new bridge popped up, and I had to cross two or three fragments before I could reach you. And there was a large door with... With what? Maybe I'm wrong. I don't want to talk some bloot. You'll have to come see it. Okay, show Oh me. yeah, right. Last time we saw a new unicorn. Oh well. Whatever they call it. They're angry, and we are out of banana. Ah, too bad. Are your bunch of cables going to remain in the entryway for a while? Why? Well, it isn't much use here, and I almost tripped on it again. It's just in case. Just in case of what? In case the nest breaks down? If you haven't found a use for them in a half-functioning ship, do you really think they'll be useful again someday? Ugh. Give me a minute to think of a scathing reply, and we'll talk about it. <laughs> Meanwhile... Meanwhile, the cables are indeed staying in the entryway. Just in case. Okay. Level up. I'm going to pop an apple brew. I'm coming. Oh, naked apron. <laughs> Do you remember why we climbed up here? Because we're allowed to do absolutely anything we want. Okay, but wouldn't we be a lot better down there, in the grass? This really isn't very comfortable. I like it here. You can feel the nest purring underneath. You must be the only person in the world who prefers the sound of an engine to silence. On Source? You bet. <sighs> Think about it. We would probably get arrested on top just for doing this. You know, what's it called? Indecent exposure. Not on truth. Really? Nope. As long as there's no deliberate intent to provoke. And how do you determine whether or not there is a deliberate intent to provoke? Hmm, that is the question. Anyway, we get arrested on truth just for being together, so... I have no idea how anyone can live like that with all of those restrictions. Don't love each other. Don't walk around naked. Don't drive over 800 an hour. To You're confusing things. You can't just reject every law. Wanna bet? One needs laws as a foundation for a society. If only to protect the weak against the stronger. <laughs> as if that's what laws are for. Uh, that's what they should be for. I'm just saying, there should only be one law. Don't be a boron. Define boron. Define, define. Ugh. No, but seriously, 
everyone knows deep down what is or isn't good. Pretty is that conclusion after observing the apiary? <sighs> All right, sure. But in the apiary, people aren't free to do what they want. And that's why it makes them frustrated, angry, self-centered. But if everyone in the world were as free as we are, as happy as we are, don't you think the world would be a better place? I think my back hurts. Don't you want to go back on the grass? Ugh, you have a real issue with freedom. We are almost max level. Alright, so it was... Okay, that's one. Thank you, Burble. Oh wait, he is not ill. There we go. <laughs> oh, it sticks in here. Same here. I feel like I should hold my nose, and, but the mere thought of this smell touching my tongue. We're gonna need to burn these suits. I don't think that will be enough. Ha! I think I found where it's coming from. Oh, who would leave the refrigerator door open like this for years? This is disgusting. Uh, you? What? Did it just move? Huh? There. There, that, that just moved, didn't it? Oh, it's alive. Abort mission. I repeat, abort mission. We're out of here. Duchess. <coughs> okay, we need to take this one. Oh, fruit. Do you think we'll have enough? We never have enough. Well, it was a pleasure meeting you guys. Ready when you are. All set. Now what? You know what to do. I got this. Your turn. I'll keep them at bay. Oh. One left. He lowered his guard. On your mark. Anytime. Oh. Bullseye. Ready when you are. Ready. You like that? You Get back. Oh, oh Blute. Go, go, Kay. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Meet my boyfriend. I got old sleep. What's up? Getting tired? This one's ready. I'm on it. Your turn. Yep. There you go. The end. Mm-hmm. <laughs> It's more the they put the kiss, no? I don't know, I know. The shrub. This one smells weird. Chuck it then. Are you insane? Oh, so many lizards. I need to scratch them all. The symbol. It's the same as on my medal. Yeah. That's what I wanted to show you. Do you understand any of this? No. And what is this? No idea. There's no button, no lever, nothing. Well, that was no. easy. What did you do? Nothing. I just waved my medal. Are you telling me that your medal is actually some kind of key? I have no idea. But in any case, it's open. So are we gonna check out the other side? Of this course. Is... Unless you have a better idea. This is exactly like uh, in the mysterious cities of gold. Okay, then. These buildings are a lot more <coughs> sinister than the others. Do you think that's the experimental plant my mom mentioned? Very likely so. Which blew everything up. It doesn't look so big. I'm guessing it goes deep, though. I don't understand. How could such a small drill cause an entire planet to explode? I guess it acted as a catalyst. S sorry, I... I still don't understand. I'm not sure I understand it either. At best, I have a hypothesis. Whatever that's worth. Please, tell me. Okay, so... You know how the planets are set up, kind of? Uh, a big flow core with crust all around it. That's right. Irena said the plant was sourcing flow directly at the core, and that it was condensing into a solid state to facilitate transport. So, that would be the rust? No. Actually, I'm thinking of something else. Whatever it was, something went wrong. And instead of condensing normally, the flow degraded into rust. And this degradation would have propagated along the drill path and into the core. Okay, there's no need to use air quotes every time. Sorry. So, then? Well, kind of like water and ice, if you will. 
the rust occupied more space than flow. When the flow core turned into rust, it expanded against the crust all around it, which ended up cracking. Kind of like leaving a bottle in the freezer for too long. And the rust leaked out of the cracks? I guess so. Otherwise, it came out of geysers, volcanoes, whatever. Uh, okay. That makes sense. Which leads me to my second question. Why do you have the key to this thing around your neck? If I knew... Kay will turn out to be a long gun royalty. There has to be another way. What was that you picked up? I'm trying to figure it out. It looks like rust, but it's a lot heavier and slicker. Let me see. Hey, it's kind of warm, too. Weird, huh? Do you think that's what they were making here? The, um, ultra-concentrated flow thing? Yes. Possibly. I'd need some time to analyze it in the nest. Hope you're not afraid of heights! Let's share those. <laughs> Look, these two are stuck. Should I open it or should you? <laughs> Kay, check this out. Ugh, the horror. What is that? <laughs> it sings too. Once more? No, nope, that should be enough. Oh, look at its face! All right, we've seen everything. Sorry, Kay, but I have to bring this back to the nest. I'm not sure that's necessary. Bring it back, or I'll make it sing again. Uh, okay, whatever. <gasps> Sorry, my finger slipped. <laughs> Are you sure this one is ripe? It passes. This is giving me a great recipe idea. No spoilers. Ooh. I love this mega spider. Alert, alert! Look at that beast! Desperate times! If that doesn't stir... Oh. And we blast off! Go! That's it! Give it it all! Ah! Go! Like that? Any other takers? Ah! Loot! More? Last red with love! Thanks! Uh, Are you okay? Don't move! No longer holding back! Go ahead! You know he dodges when he's like this. Yeah, well, sorry. I'm doing what I can. Back to nothingness. Luckily, you were here. We got lucky.
On your mark. Go, go, go! This one's ready. On it. Nice shot. Ugh. Are you okay? Your turn. One down. Done and done. One to go. Ugh. Cover me. You know what to do. I'm on it. Bye-bye. That's how we rock. You know, we don't have to clean up the whole islet. We don't have to do anything. That's the best part. Yeah, but I want to. All clean. There we go. Okay, so we'll have to go back home. Chickens! Ugh, it's getting cold. Do you want a warm snuggle? Maybe later. All right, so we need to find a way on the other side. Ooh. Whoa! May I? A steel plate has a nice leading edge. I'm wondering, maybe if I rigged the wing root a bit, added a safety slat here, shaved down the trailing edge, yep, this should make a completely viable semi-airfoil. Awesome! Semi-airfoil are a kind of curtain, aren't they? <sighs> wings. They're wings. For flying. Ah, uh, yeah, that makes a lot more sense. Are we really gonna lug that around? It looks heavy. We could just take it with the two of us. It should be okay. <laughs> this art is fun. Perfect. We just need a little rust to hold it all together now. This is starting to look pretty good. Soon we may okay? be able to fly. Laying back? As much as I can. I can see that. I was thinking. Any idea why I'm always in charge of hanging the laundry out to dry? Because I'm doing all the washing? Big deal. You just need to stick it in the machine. Where do you see a washing machine? <laughs> okay, good point. I'll finish hanging the laundry. Okay. Mm. So. This isn't gonna go very far without rust. Top propeller, a left wing, and... A turbine. Okay, okay. Just 
carrot dude. Who is the food fridge? This one doesn't look very good. Let's not judge based on appearances. We were right. So, is this rust or is this not rust? Depends on how you define rust. A kind of ruddy substance that dissolves in flow? Then it's not rust. It has the same components, but no matter how much flow I throw at it, it won't budge. On the contrary, flow seems to evaporate when they come into contact. Evaporate? Yeah. I don't know if that's the right word. It's absorbed, consumed. I, I mean, it disappears. Oh, yeah. Then it's like hyper rust. If you will. So, to summarize, hyper rust dissolves flow, which dissolves rust. Maybe rust dissolves hyper rust. That would be like rock, paper, scissors. No, no, rust and hyper rust, as you call it, have no effect upon one another. Too bad. I really like rock, paper, scissors. I win every time. <laughs> I know. And I still don't understand how you do it. It's statistically impossible. If you think rock, paper, scissors has to do with statistics, you have really missed the point of rock, paper, scissors. One day I will uncover this mystery. All in due time. First, hyper rust, then rock, paper, scissors. Okay. <laughs> Whose turn is it to clean out the shower? If you have to ask, that means it's yours. Okay. It's a bit late to start cooking food. Okay. Let's... Oh. You. You. <laughs> we need to turn off the spud, baby. Oh. I had to go last time. It's your turn. It's your spud baby. Uh, it's our spud baby. But I never wanted it. Well, you should have thought about that. What's mine is yours. That means for better or for worse. We not just drain the batteries once and for all? <gasps> I am going to pretend that I didn't hear that. I'm warning you, it's the last time. Sure, sure. <laughs> uh, I think it's pretty catchy. You see, it's not that hard. That's not the issue. <sighs> okay, we'll drain the battery. Okay. I'm I'm taking a little break. I I come back in like five minutes.
Okay, it was it wasn't even five minutes. <laughs> so we need to explore here. There's something here, but I didn't find how to go. Cool. There's something here, and at one point we should go back to the swamp. Mm hmm. Mm. I feel there's something here that we're missing. Uh. You can cook too. Stop it. I just skewered a bunch of vegetables. Even still, it tastes great. Through none of my doing. But it does taste great. That's so cute. Did you find it? No. You'll have to hold on a little longer. I still think that I could have reached that shelf by climbing on a chair. Sure, but you don't know where to look. Neither do you, apparently. I was thinking of something mean to reply, but I'll wait till I'm off your shoulders. Good thinking. Are you sure it's here? Well, it's the most inaccessible part of the nest. So yes, chances are that's where I put it. Okay, but considering that even while standing on a chair, you can't reach the shelf, whose head was between your thighs when you decided to put it away? Uh. You do not ask those questions of a lady. And anyway, all of your questions will be answered as soon as I... Ha! Huh. I got it! You can put me down. So? Give it to me. Oh no. I will let you see my diary, because I'm nice. But first, I have to check that there's nothing embarrassing in it. It's a diary. It's designed to be embarrassing. Nothing too embarrassing. Okay. Okay, I think we are ready. Uh, maybe synthesize some med medicine. Okay. Let's go. Do you think that the big door is still open? I hope so. Looks like the birds already had a crack at it. As long as they're leaving some for us. Okay, so... 
Let's look at the map. I want to go here, but I think first we need to explore down the air. The swamp, swamp shuttle will take it another time. Okay, so I'm not going top, so we have to go the other way. Now we're talking. This is exactly what an unknown planet should feel like. Have you ever seen this color grass? Only a blood. What's up? Did you get a cold? I told you, you have to cover up your butt at night. It's a prime target for colds. <laughs> Do you need a hanky? <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. Should I start to worry? I'm okay. I'm okay. I think my allergies are acting up. You have allergies? A pair. This is quite unfortunate. It will pass. I just need my immune system to acclimatize itself. You want to backtrack? No, no, it's. <sighs> you okay? There's a sneeze stuck in my nose. What? What are the switch? <laughs> you need to pull out one eyebrow hair. Huh? It'll make you sneeze. Wait, stay still. <clears throat> Ow! Are you insane? So squeamish. I didn't even manage to pull it out. Good thing you didn't. Is that sneeze still stuck? No. See? You have no reason to complain. Okay. Saw that. Boo! Stop it! You're scaring them. We're speeding toward them, and you think my what? boo is the scary part? Oh no. Poor guy. <laughs> They're right behind us. Three, two, one. Go, go, go! Uh. Are you okay? You? Yep, saw that. 
On your mark. Ooh, that looks bad. What's up? Getting tired? Ready? Now! Let's get it over with. And done. Ready? Almost done. Now shoot! We make a good team. <laughs> what a glutton. On your mark. Anytime. Nice one. All set. Go, go, go! Starting to look pretty tired. On your mark. Now! Ah! You! Keep them coming. Your turn. I'm on it. Go, Kay! Ah. Are you all right? You know what to do. I got this. This one's ready. Yep. Target left. One left. I got this. Got it. Ugh. He lowered his guard. You know what to do. On it. This one's ready. Yep. Bye bye. <laughs> We're that good. Who wants some good flow? Kind of reminds me of someone. Who? Uh, whatever. Banana. Seven to six. Don't. <laughs> what a glutton. Finally, I was starting to get bored. Now I can start playing for real. Hmm. Then my controller is acting up. Oh, another abandoned drone. Poor little guy. He must be wondering where everyone went. What kind is that? Uh, drop hat. Drone for autonomous pat roll? Almost. Drone for autonomous patty cake. It's a drone that plays patty cake. Uh. No, I'm joking. It's patrol. <laughs> Looks like this one's fully loaded. It's got hypo propellers. Is that good or not good? Adds a lot of weight, uses a lot of energy, but it allows you to land on uneven terrain. Like if we didn't have those on the nest, we would have crashed. Pretty good then. Pretty good. Let's take it. Right now or? Hmm. Yeah, to the nest. Okay, let's get to work. A job well done. So, as the mistress of the house, how do you like it? <gasps> yes! This looks a whole bloop better now. I'm sorry, take two. That wasn't a very mistressy answer. <clears throat> Well, sir, I dare say that these lanterns and curtains in the entranceway are adding an undeniable flair to this humble ship. Oh, do they? My lady, I do declare these tapestries were hand-sewn from the utmost luxurious bath towels. Delightful. 
And these luminaries were handcrafted using the ancient art of papier-mâché. You don't say. Truly, Master K, you have worked some miracles. Uh, I cannot wait to observe what you have achieved with the interior adornments. If you would please follow me into the bedroom. Oh, oh Master K, how cavalier. <laughs> I am sorry, my dear. I don't know what came over me. Might your presence be giving me vertigo, as it were? That was nonsense. Carry on with the scene. Oh. <clears throat> what do you say we take a look at the dining room? I am eager to discover the delectable feast which your kitchen clerks have prepared for us. Yes. <clears throat> I'm afraid my clerks have taken leave for the day. Thus... We shall content ourselves with your own cooking talents, <laughs> as I am sure you would never allow for a lady's stomach to stand idle. I would then never stop flirting. Okay, maybe it's too late to go do something. I think I'm gonna stop here because I have uh, uh, some work to do, so... I'm gonna make them sleep and then... Wait, eating them. I call shower. I call second. <gasps> oh, your feet are freezing. <laughs> well, yeah. Why do you think I'm trying to warm them up on you? Can't you use the comforter? Doesn't work. Well, try a hot water bottle or something. You're my hot water bottle. Mmm. Think about it. Which do you prefer? Cold feet on your calves at this very moment, just long enough to warm them up, or sleeping in fear that my cold feet will touch you by chance during the night and wake you up with a jolt? <sighs> Okay, go ahead. Ah. <laughs> 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 okay. And and let's stop here for today thanks for coming to the stream and uh have a good day bye